not sure how well this will come out because it's a new tablet. So, um, let's see how it goes. So I thought I'd talk about the fungus that I had in my 65 gallon. Um, I don't really know how it started. I just know it started when I put in my um, rainbow fish. These are my turquoise rainbow fish. And they were in the tank with the rummy nose, so quite obviously the rummy nose had the fungus and they passed it to one of my um, rainbow fish. As you see, I've only got two now, I've lost one. It did have um, white marks on its mouth, which I thought was an injury from being caught. It quite obviously was the disease, and he or she brought it to this tank. Um, now this was completely different than my other tanks, really. Um, I lost a few males um, in my guppies, um, old males. But every time my females were giving birth, they were dying straight after. It's very rare I lose um, female guppies after they give birth. So that was a bit of a, a shock. So um, how did I treat this tank? Well, because my um, rainbow fish already had a sore mouth, I was using um, Malifix already and i had been using it for about three days and then somebody said to use the primer fix i don't know i forgot to check before i started this video <laughs> as to what it was anyway the one that goes with the malifix and so i started that as well and i used both of them in this tank for seven days each um within about four or five days I stopped losing fish. Um, mostly the females here were showing me uh, saddleback symptoms um, and a few of them were showing the more blue veiny at the end of their tail symptoms. Um, as you see a lot of my females in here are very very old. You can actually see how they swim when they're old. Um, you know, we're talking about fish that are 18 months old and they've been having babies for, you know, all that time near enough. So, um, I didn't use any strong chemicals in here, I just used those two products. Um, none of my other fish uh, died during that period, although I did lose two black neons. Now, I do put down the losses to the females being pregnant and to the black neons um, down to the introduce, introducing the rainbow fish. The rainbow fish really did mistake the black neons as rainbow fish and they were chasing them about everywhere and that caused a lot of stress for the older, rainbow, uh, the older um, black neons. So, um, I lost two of the bigger ones. Um, I also believed that the death of the female guppies was also down to stress a bit because they were just stressing out with the rainbows darting everywhere. Um, now that everybody's settled in, um, it seems to be a lot better. But I did seem to get rid of the fungus without using a stronger medication in this tank. Um, so perhaps it's worth trying that first. So there was no um, melting of my plants, as you kind of see. I have a huge ball of plants in there. There's just hundreds of baby guppies. I don't know if you'll be able to see them. Uh, just a ton of them hiding in there. That's why Victor's underneath. He just waits for the babies to swim out. So that's really how I cured the tank of the fungus in here. Um, it's 
but everybody else seems to be doing quite well. The rainbows have really settled in in here now. There's no problems at all. They don't stress out anybody anymore.